Okay, here it is. Just got done finishing the Dura coating on the stock. So that is it. Got the muzzle brake on there. Got the new stock, a Harris bipod, a Vortex Viper scope, six and a half to twenty. Just gonna kind of zoom around, get a look at the camouflage on it. It's a Duracoat colors, Bell and Carlson stock. Headed out to the range, shoots good, half inch groups. So that is it. That is what a Hawa looks like after you got a bunch of mods done to it. And that's pretty much it. It's kind of a progress, but it looks good. There's the Carson's cheek piece. You can see it better. Got a lot of that black out of there that drove me nuts. Don't like a lot of black on my rifles, but just the action and the barrels and the scopes fine with me. Looks pretty good that way. Again, multicam colors, match multicam stuff. And that's about it. That's what a Howa can look like, other than the ones that you find in the store that are kind of whatever, whatever, and got their Hogue stocks, whatever. This is a little bit different twist, the Bell and Carlson on there. And uh, tactical use, hunting use. See a lot of guys on the internet claiming they throw a scope on a bolt-action rifle and it's a sniper rifle. It's typically not the case. Oh, and I also wanted to show you guys something on here. I got the uh, the bubble level on there. I can see it right down there, the little green thing. That helps quite a, quite a bit to do for the cant and stuff on the rifle, so that solves a lot of issues there. Keeps it from canting this way or that. Keeps the rifle level so you don't pull shots right or left. Uh, it's just a really cheap model, but I like it. Seems to work good so far, so I'll put it through the test. Let you guys know what the story is with that. That's it. Any questions, just uh, give me a holler on the YouTube channel, and I'll answer them the best I can.